You have said that in your opinion Gog is America and Magog is Russia, slightly different. I said that the Western alliance, the NATO alliance, which is led by America, by the United States, I choose to refer to them as Gog and the Russian-led alliance to be Magog and that these two are the two powers in the world who have, as, as the Hadith al-Qudsi says, a power so great that none but I can destroy them, says the Hadith al-Qudsi. What is the difference between the tribe of Gog and the tribe of Magog? And what has you made, why did you make this opinion? Why Russia as Gog and Ru United States as Gog and Russia as Magog? I do this because Gog, Ya'juj is the active participle and Ma'juj is the passive. And I recognize the American-led alliance to be the major villain in bringing facade to the world. And the Russian-led alliance to be behind the Americans, not in front of them. That's why I said this one is Ya'juj, or the active participle, and that one is Ma'juj, or the passive participle. Who are Gog and Magog? They are human beings. They are not some strange creature living in the interior of the earth. That's Disneyland thinking. They are human beings. The barrier built by Zulkarnain was destroyed by Allah in the lifetime of Nabi Muhammad And if you don't want to believe this that I have said, fine, you can accept that the barrier is still there. We don't have to be divided and be, be fighting with each other over it. No. I say the barrier is gone, it's destroyed. You say the barrier is still there. So why do we have to be fighting and dividing ourselves with each other over this? And why do you have to be throwing mud at me over this? That's shameful, really. We can differ. We can differ respectively. I'm not speaking disrespectfully of you, in your opinion. No. All I'm saying is if the barrier is still standing, why aren't you searching for it? I think there's a question of credentials here. If a barrier built by Zulkarnain mentioned in the Quran, a geographical reality mentioned in the Quran is still standing on the face of the earth, not buried beneath the surface of the earth. What kind of Disneyland thinking is that? If it is there standing on the face of the earth, why are you not searching for it? Why has no human being seen and recognized that barrier in 1400 years? and more since the Qur'an was revealed. Why? My answer is because it's already been destroyed. But you don't accept that answer. You say Imran Hussein is misguided. Don't listen to Imran Hussein. Fine. That's shameful. Scholars don't behave like that. I never said to anyone, don't listen to this one, don't listen to that one, don't listen to that one. I don't do that. No. I have more respect for my people. So why aren't you searching for it? If Gog and Magog have been released, then we can understand the facade in the world today, universal facade. Inna ya'juja wa ma'juja mufsiduna fil up. If they are released in the world, they are the agents of facade. They are the ones who have brought the Jews back to the Holy Land to reclaim it as their own. Then it's very easy for us to recognize who they are. They are modern Western civilization of the East and of the West. Of the East is Russia, of the West is United States and Britain and France, Europe, 